Right. If you watch Emmerdale, you will know it's been, well, a turbulent year for Ryan Lamb. A new family, an affair with his half-sister, and most recently, he, he was framed. Framed for, for his father's murder. He was. So uh, last week, James Sutton, who plays Ryan, dropped in for a chat with our Friday presenters, Amanda Byram and Paddy McGuinness. Now, if I was a few years younger, this young man would do me nicely. Aww. What would you do if I said I had a day of work and an empty house? God, you're beautiful. Why would you tell me that my dad was dead? You've lied to me my whole life. How much more is there? Oh, no, 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 no. She's, she's my sister. Well, she's my half-sister, technically. It's kind of complicated. Yeah, I don't like being accused of things I haven't done! Didn't do it. Didn't set up. Oh! Didn't do it. It wasn't me. Hello there. Hello. Good, Good to have you here and not in prison. And not in prison, <laughs> out of my scrubs for a change. Yeah. Oh my goodness! What an incredible year you have had. It's been pretty chaotic. Yeah, yeah, it's been crazy. You've been been you know in love with several women. You've, oh, you've there's yeah. been a there's been a few. I was yeah. just watching the clip there. You you yeah. Who chose get, sexy get... boy as the music? Well, you are. <laughs> A sexy boy, oh, what a man, oh, might I add. Well, let me tell you, you're kissing a lot of gorgeous girls there. Tough life. <laughs> it's hard. Yeah. Oh. It's hard. Oh, my. <laughs> Have you had a brilliant year? Because it really only has been a year since you've, you've yeah, been on the show. Yeah, it's been ama it's been amazing. It's flown by actually, but um, it's been fab. It's, I've had some good storylines, and the actors are amazing. And we film in an amazing location in Leeds. It's just yeah. it's it's wicked. It's the best. Job. On a, on a, on a soul, does everybody kind of are they aware of storylines? Or is it so secretive that you just turn in one day and they go, "We've got this <laughs> amazing storyline for you." And, learn that basically. Yeah, pretty much, because the turnover is so quick. Um, we're constantly filming, so you don't actually have a chance to have a chat to anyone and find out what's going on. So you just get a script for it. It's like, oh, wow, OK, I'm, this is happening so now. So it's really it? oh, okay. spontaneous yeah, acting. Yeah. Well, listen, let's talk about the plot line of all plot lines. You're going down, down, <laughs> down. It's all, it's all happening. Oh, so, you know, obviously you haven't done it. No. What are the chances of you getting away with this, do you think? Uh, Slim to none. Oh, no. I've been I've been stitched up like a kipper. Ooh. I really have. There's there's a there's a gun that's been buried. My jewellery's been planted on the body. Gunshot residue. And and I might have mentioned that I wanted to kill my dad yeah. before he was murdered. Oh, things, so, things yeah, a bit not, of not looking good. It's no, not looking it's great. Not. It's no, and I'm, I'm I'm in trouble. And you have, I mean, I've read that you've actually filmed some scenes in a prison, so is that a little giveaway? Yeah, I'm, with a, with a murder case, uh, they don't give you bail, because oh. you might be a bit dangerous. So yeah. I've got <laughs> three months, I think, in, 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 a, in a cell. Did you, did you actually do any research? Did you go to a proper prison? No, I uh, just watched Shawshank Redemption. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. yeah. So I'm, you, I'm lazy, yeah. Paddy, I'm not going to lie. Porridge. So yeah, Good exactly. Yeah. yeah, That's the one. Yeah. <laughs> we, filmed, we filmed in a, a Category A prison when we were doing Max and Paddy, a proper one. Did you? Oh, it's, it's daunting. I'm sure it's not did you, did you, did you meet, the, imagine. meet the prisoners and stuff? Yeah. I met one fella that I was talking to, having a chat, and I went away when the, the warner said, He's just doing 35 years for a double murder. I'm like, oh, with nice scary. <laughs> Things that they, I'm sure, will not put you through. Yeah, I, I'm not. I'm not in any. I'm not with any uh, any any wrong ones. <laughs> well, listen. Um, if you get away with this, if if if, if and uh, and if you go down and then they find out it wasn't you, who would you like to see go down for it? Obviously, Nathan. Yeah, my my evil little brother. Mm. I think he's hateful. He what is a hateful. What a despicable creature. Yeah. Are you mates off screen though? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh. Yeah. We, we go. We uh, we go on mandates. <laughs> together. I like Monday. A bit of bromance. I'm, I'm bromance. having a bromance tonight. All my friends With are coming around my house. that guy who's 35 years? <laughs> oh, no. No. I don't want to talk about that, Amanda. <laughs> no, all my friends are coming around my house tonight and uh, we get the Xbox out. I'm 36. Yeah. But I'm still grow clinging up, on to my youth. And we just have a bit of a night in. We order all the food in and have a few beers and whatever. It's great. I love a good bromance. Yeah. Have a cuddle. It's, it's, yeah, it's well, nothing I don't want to go that far, James. It's, it's a line we don't cross. Yeah. Things to keep in your head, James. Yeah. So, so let's talk about, you know, obviously Emmerdale is doing wonderfully for you. Yeah. Do you have any aspirations to go I'm, further to Hollywood? I'm not, to La La I, I, yeah, I mean, I'm not. I'm not the most ambitious of people in that sense. I just love, I just love acting. I just love my job. And, and, and Emmerdale uh, Soap is one of the few jobs that lets you do it every single day. 
you know, it's a it's, it's brilliant. Every day I get to go to work and do what I love doing. So. You is know, it I'm is not... it easy, you know, in a soap to kind of get used to that, you know, acting and just think, oh, I've got a job. It's, I'm, yeah, you know, yeah, I'm in every week and yeah, you have, you know, you've got, you know, you've got to motivate yourself. You know, every every, every scene's important, be it a big dramatic one in a mm. prison or you know, just I, passing the time in the wall pack. And... I uh, I had an audition for Emmerdale Did you? Like six years ago. Hilarious. Um, obviously, you didn't what? get it. <laughs> well, obviously <laughs> not because I'm rubbish. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but I do sit me out to, to people who, who are in soaps because they get referred to as, as soap soap stars. Well, they're actors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Actors. I, I don't think there's. I, I think there was a, maybe a bit of snobbery years ago. I think, but now, I mean, it's this, this, this is the high top of its game. I mean, you know, Emmerdale in particular is doing brilliantly. And Absolutely, you go through yeah. such a range of, of acting emotions. You Absolutely. know, sleeping with your half sister. Yeah. All that, that kind what of other, stuff. What other job lets you sleep with your half sister? <laughs> <laughs> what a party that was. Oh, I tell you what, we la laughed, we nearly cried. Well, listen, we will be watching with bated breath to see what happens. I hope you don't get banged up for too long. Yeah, thank you. Because we need to see. You look You look much better in, in your casual gear than Bless you do in you, your scrubs. You James, thank you so Thanks much for coming, for coming in, James. in today.